guys, it's Omi. Um, today I wanted to show you this kind of weird program I found called Paperback. It is like, it's a backup tool, but it's kind of weird because it prints these like, it prints like these dot based images with your printer. So you drag a file into this program and then you basically get a printout of the file, whatever type of file it is. I think it says like you can print out three megabytes per page. I know this is totally like not not something most people would use as a backup program, but I don't know if you don't have a USB stick or something, maybe you could use this. I just thought it was kind of cool how it did this. But anyway, you like uh, you get your file like right here. I had this happy cow file, and then you drag it into paperback. I'm not gonna do it now, but then what it does is it prints out. Um, it uses your printer and it gives you this like little sheet of paper. I'll show you two here. It's just like this one bar of random dots and stuff. And then what you can do with that is, if you have a scanner, you can put it back into your scanner. So you scan it in. And I guess I'll show you how to do that now, or I'll do that now with my thing. And for some reason, my HP Office Direct, the Twain, uh, whatever it's called, the feed thingy, doesn't work. And this thing always crashes when I try to obtain the image through, um, through my scanner. So I have to get the image as a bitmap file from Paint. Which is pathetic, I know, but whatever, so... So we're going to scan from the camera. And you have to make sure your DPI on the scanner is uh, they recommend you use at least 600. So then I scan this in paint. Okay, and now the scan just finished. So I'm going to look at here. Here's the scanned image. It's very zoomed in right now. Let me see if I can zoom out on that. See if I can find it, if it even scanned it right. Aha, uh -huh, there it is. And as you see here, it said, for some reason I call that file, dude is a cow. And then here are the, like, the little dot thingies that it uses. And then I'm going to save this. And it has to be a bitmap format, a raw bitmap. So this file is probably going to be humongo. I'll call this humongo. And I'll save it just as a 24-bit bitmap. It's going to take a while to save because it's so huge. Okay. So then now I can open that bitmap. Humongo is 102 megabytes. I turned this, uh, this 3 kilobyte file into a 102 megabyte bitmap by doing this. So it's kind of weird, but anyway. And then what it does is it processes the image as it's doing now, looking at all the dot thingies, I guess. Okay, and now it just finished. So now it says, what do I, it gives me the option, I save it, dude is a cow, dot, what is it, a JPEG. So I save that. And now here I have my original happy cow. And here I have my backed up dude is a cow from the scan that I just did. And it didn't have any bugs, it actually worked, so I'm like, wow, that's kind of cool. And I'm doing this with like a $50 HP Office Jet that I got on a discount from Walmart. So, yeah, it works with just about any printer as far as I can tell. And I know it's not really, not really useful for most people, but... I just thought it was kind of cool, so that's why I showed it to you. Ciao.